Marvelous piece of fun by Percy Granger, born in Australia. Great career in uh, both the British Isles and uh, in the United States. He got married on the stage of the Hollywood Bowl. Granger lived 1882 to 1961, a tad eccentric, but very talented. We heard his Handle in the Strand, an imaginative piece, with piano soloist Catherine Edwards and the BBC Philharmonic, conducted by Richard Hickox. And at 1.32, time to welcome a very special guest on Bill's Classical Jukebox. John McLeish was named uh, Toronto's 2013 Lawyer of the Year in Personal Injury Litigation by Best Lawyers in Canada. John is the co-author of three published books on personal injury litigation. And he is here with us now in conversation with John Vendriel. Okay, first of all, John, I, I guess one of the top questions would be, what is PIA law, Personal Injury Alliance Law? PIA Law is three law firms, Thompson Rogers, Oatley Bigman, and McLeish Orlando. They are three law firms who represent injured individuals in personal injury cases and uh, are lawyers that have been doing it uh, in some cases for a long time and have a lot of expertise in representing injured individuals in traumatic uh, injury cases. Well, now, I look, at, I look at some of the background information you have about the law firm and what you do, and one of you state the case quite strongly that one of the most important things for an individual to do is to get a, a lawyer who has the proper credentials and experience to represent them. And so it's, it sounds like there's a lot of firms and lawyers who don't have that background. That's very true. It is very difficult in the modern area here in Toronto, especially in Ontario, because of all the radio and television advertising for a person to to get the right lawyer. Now, there's a lot of people that advertise that, that don't have the experience or the expertise to represent someone who's been seriously injured. And the three law firms of the PIA uh, recognize this, and uh, we... Um, got together to try and inform the public uh, of our experience and expertise in, in personal injury law. Most other lawyers know it. Uh, a lot of the rehab community knows it. Uh, but someone who's not dealing with lawyers on a, on a regular basis would have no idea uh, how to choose a, a experienced and, and good lawyer from someone with less experience and, and not so good. Is that partly because of the litigation in, the, in this field is so much more complex? Uh, the litigation is, is very complex in this field. The law is always, always changing, and you have to keep up with it. You have to be specialized, and that's, that's one of the reasons. I mean, there's, there's, there's others. It's uh, besides law, uh, a lawyer in this field has to know the very best health professionals who can help an injured person. It's uh, once a person's out, out of the hospital, they're outside of the OHIP funded system. And a, a lawyer has to know the very best um, neuropsychologists, say in, in, in a brain injury case or speech language pathologist, the number one concern of an injured person at, at the beginning is is not how much money I'm going to get is I want to make, I want to get better. How can I get better? And the lawyers of the PIA know the very best rehab professionals in the industry, be it brain injury, be it spinal cord, be it orthopedic. So that's, that's one thing that, uh, that Personal Injury Alliance lawyers can bring to the table is that knowledge. And another aspect is just the fees that lawyers charge. Uh, the fees are... Um, not the difficult part for an injured person. Um, what is, 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 is difficult, uh, it, impossible, but let me put impossible for an injured person, is to pay the expenses that are associated, say, with, a, for example, a neuropsychological assessment. That can easily be five or $6,000. The lawyers in the Personal Injury Alliance will fund that. You might need a neurologist uh, report. You might need an orthopedic report. The expenses that a lawyer incurs n have nothing to do with fees can easily, easily be fifty thousand, a hundred thousand, a hundred and fifty thousand dollars in in one case. And as you might expect, a lot of a lot of 
uh, lawyers and law firms can't can't afford that when you that's just one case when you think they're they're going to have have many cases so yeah it's 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 the average person not even the average person a well to do person cannot afford to fund one of these cases if a family member has been injured so there's no money up front is basically absolutely what you're none no and if and a lawyer asks uh, a client for i guess 15 to 20%, which I guess is not unheard of. Uh, at, at the end of the day, that's, 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 what, that's what fees are. Um, and that's, say, after several years of the lawyer and the law firm uh, funding the case. And when you look at, at it as part of the overall settlement, keeping in mind, keeping in mind that the insurance company p- pays part of that. It's the fees... Uh, are very reasonable. So when, when when we're talking about personal injuries, is are 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 there a certain type of injury that are that are we see a lot of litigation for right now, or how does that when you talk about personal injury, what does that actually mean? Yeah, the type of injuries can vary right 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 across the spectrum from in sore sore necks and and, and backs and what are called soft tissue injuries up to the you know, multiple fractures, brain injury cases, spinal cord cases. The three firms of, of the Personal Injury Alliance just uh, represent individuals in, in the latter category. That's a serious orthopedic cases and brain injury cases and spinal cord cases. And that, that's not to say that, that people with, with soft tissue injuries to their neck or back aren't, aren't deserving of compensation. They... They are. It's just uh, we've we've had to make a choice, and type of cases we take on. We don't take on a lot of cases. We're um, selective about the cases we take on. We put a lot of time, a lot of resources, and a lot of energy into them. So they they have to be uh, the more significant uh, injury cases. Well, listen, I could we could go on for another hour. Unfortunately, we don't have that much time. But I thank you for joining me, and I'll direct uh, people for more information to your website, which is www.pialaw.ca. That's pialaw.ca. Thank you so much. 